what's good you all and welcome to my review of this week's episode of Dragon Ball Super. And it's finally here, guys, the start of a new arc. We no more, you know, readapting movies like, you know, Resurrection of F and Battle of Gods. Because even though, Greg, guys, I never saw Battle of Gods, especially when they came out in theaters when the Blu-rays came out. Never got around to seeing those movies. So it's when I watched Super, when I watched my son in Super, that was the first time I saw it, so yeah. And yeah, we have now started to resurrect the, um... The res of the, the the universe six arc or the shop arc, whatever this arc is called, fresh all new material. I'm very excited, hyped to see you know what Super has in store for me now with all this new fresh material. I but I'm most hot, but the one arc I am definitely looking forward to seeing is definitely uh, Goku Black, mostly because you know I get my boy Trunks returns, future Trunks. Goku, and season just seeing Goku Black, and also I literally can't go five minutes without seeing somebody in a Goku Black shirt. <laughs> Yeah, what's up? So we start this episode off with a training set, with a training montage, with some training between Goku and Vegeta at uh, Beerus' world. They're doing uh, one finger push ups. Well, uh, one, 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 they're not really push ups. Like, what? I don't know. They're doing those one finger. I'm going to call them one finger push ups, even though they're not really. Cause they're like, but they're standing like the one finger handstands. I guess I could go. I don't know if that exercise is even called, but whatever. They're doing that. They, I believe they reached about 100 and, uh, not 100, uh, 50,000, I believe the number was, uh, before Shoppa shows up. Yeah, so then, uh, something crashes, which is, uh, Shoppa and Vados, I believe her name is, the female-looking lease, I think that's her name, yeah, Vados. And it pretty much is, you know, and pretty much, uh, Beerus, and Beerus ain't having this shit, because, you know, he's trying to sleep for God knows how long, and, you know, we got Goku, Vegeta, and Weasel, they're keeping my brother up. So they ain't having that. So then, so, you know, Beerus is just in a flying high blast like a madman, and Shoma just sitting there be like, ha ah, ha Beerus, Beerus, Beerus. So then they walk over there, and my boy Shoma's over there sweating like I'm over there, and like, the dude just ran a marathon. I mean, like, dude, you are not even running. You are just walking, you're that out of breath, and he starts chugging down some, like, he starts chugging down some Red Bull or whatever that, that energy drink. <laughs> And so he's like, and he's like, yeah, we can fight there because he had miles. I, 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 I've like lost more calories than I gave from drinking this shit, from drinking it. I don't know, so it's like, I'm not, just like, naked, hey, whatever. Damn. So they end up, so they eventually do get to the door, which after when they did the door opens, uh, my, uh, 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 Chopper does like, the, does like some Neo Matrix dodging, you know, and he just barely hits him. Very, and then he gets, and then he gets up, he's like looking for Goku and Vegeta because they thought that was, that was made, the, you know, the, the, the noise, you know, the noise of the explosion of their crashing, was he finds, which, um, Shoppa's like, hey, Beerus, uh, hey, Beerus, and he's like, there you are, they just start firing Kai Blast, they missed, they, they just barely missed, um, uh, Shoppa, and then, and then, and then after a while, he's, um, and after some, after, you know, once the smoke clears, he realizes that's Shoppa, not Goku, and Vegeta, so then, so you have to go back into, um, Goku's, um, into Beerus' house, you know, and they're pretty much just talking about, you know, um, how Chomp is the only reason he's here is just to show off, you know, some food from Universe 6. So he brings out these, um, hard-boiled eggs from Universe 6. Which, and which Goku and Vegeta actually tried to actually, actually, what they actually really like about the, the Goku kind of represents the audience in this episode because he's like, one of the first things he says when he meets, um, a Chomp is like, hey, which one's stronger, Beerus or you? And and, and I love and Vado says you know well judging by from from their physiques it's obvious <laughs> yeah um so yeah again so their permit everyone tries them Beerus Wee's uh, Goku and Vegeta they try their permit just normal uh well the next thing one thing I forgot to mention actually when they're doing those like you know one finger push ups or whatever that exercise is called uh, they're actually wearing these like these um heavy suits these suits they like give them they have more resistance than you know the uh, gravity chamber that uh B that Bulma that Vegeta uses all the time uh, with ball that the Bulma Bulma created for Vegeta for Vegeta you know like the thing we see him a couple times so this has more resistance and uh, it's harder than you know that that you know that chamber I mean and so yeah they try to everyone's like no it's just normal eh? and then and Beerus brings us some food from you know Universe Seven. It kept, brings up, guess what? Instant ramen. Yes, the same instant ramen, the same thing Vegeta used to get Whis to give him to train him. And one thing I actually love about this episode is that it's ironic because these are guys, because these are like godly beasts, you know, uh, Bo, um, um, Chapa and uh, Vados. And they're and then when they tried the ramen, they're like, they're like, 
they're, they're like so shocked how good it is. They're like just they're just, they're just chucking that thing down, and, and he's like, yeah, yeah. And they like it's the kind of funny because we do because these are godly bees and they're eating shit that you can get at Walmart for sixty eight cents. Some top ramen. Anyway. So yeah, they still eat so, uh, uh, keep saying beers. <laughs> Chopper is like, oh, that was, it's just okay. And Beerus is like, well, you sure just gotta go down cooking for something that was just okay. <laughs> so then they see, then, um, after some time, then they uh, talk about, you know, and then Beerus, uh, and then Goku asks, like, you know, what do you mean, like, um, that, that's the twin brothers, and then, uh, please explain, you know, the, the, dra the multiverse within Dragon Ball, which there's 12 universes, and each one, uh, mirrors each other if they equal 13, so, you know, 1 and 12 mirror each other, um, you know, 6 and 7, etc., they all mirror each other. And Bro just explains that, and then actually, after a while, we get to see, um, we, um, he, he says, like, hey, why don't we have, because then he's talking about, and actually, oh, actually, yeah, actually, when he asks about the raw, after he eats the rum, he, like, tells a to look for, like, an Earth, to, like, look for Earth in the, uh, Universe 6, which he, which he does, but it ends up, it's actually destroyed, because, you know, the humans destroyed it. And so, yeah, then after that, so, yeah, then, um, uh, blah, blah, I keep saying Beerus. Choppa wants to tell him, like, hey, why don't, hey, why don't we have a, why don't we have a competition, and whoever wins, uh, between you and me, and whoever wins gets, and we swap, and whoever wins, swaps that person's earth with the other, and, and which, Beerus allows us to have, because, like, you, because Choppa, because the died meant, like, you know, Beerus versus Choppa, the fight, which, which actually wasn't, because, you know, that would destroy the entire, that would destroy both Universe 6 and 7 if they had a battle. Which you see a little bit of, but it, which you see a little bit of, then they just, you know, just a like, little scuffle, they have some punches. They actually, uh, first thing that happens is, like, purple, like, aura around them, almost, it kind of, like, keeps going farther and farther and farther. The uh, match goes on, and Goku and Vegeta are trying to get back from it. And after they're finally done, after Reese and, um, Agla Avados get, in, get involved, they're like, you know, we're not gonna have this going on, because, you know, you'll destroy the Earth. Uh, Goku puts his foot down on it, and then the whole floor collapses. And then after yeah, they're taught, and then after that we find out they have some like you know competition of fighters, you know the best fighters from Universe Six and Universe Seven. And yeah, for the and then he talks about like you know how and Beerus is, and uh, Beerus is talking about like you know how can you swap Earths? You know you don't have the power to do that. And he brings up the Super Dragon Balls, the Dragon Balls in Universe Six, which I guess that's where the Super in Dragon Ball Super comes in. Because I was always curious on why Dragon Ball Super was called Dragon Ball Super. I guess I now would know why. So he's talking about the Super Dragon Balls. Um, you know, and then he talked about, like, you know, he has six of them already, he needs to find one more, and, yeah, he needs to find one more Dragon Ball to complete the collection to it, you know, make the wish, of course, uh, the soup, you know, so he could swap Earth to the guy with a uh, tournament, so, you know, to decide on, like, if, like, Universe 7 wins, they keep Earth, if Universe 6 wins, they take, um, Universe 7's Earth, and they get all the, and they get all that good food, and then after that, so yeah, that's around where the episode ends, pretty much. It's around where I'm trying to think if I forgot anything to mention. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything. I got Goku. Yeah, I'm, I, yeah I think that's everything. Yeah, the first time I'm like, you know, let's have a tournament. Let's see who wins. Oh yeah, Vegeta says that, new, and appears like, you know, what use are your six if you don't have the last one? Which, you know, Vegeta says like, you know, Bulma got hook up a. Great machine to find the last, uh, you know, the last super driver. So that's what the episode ends. Um, overall, fantastic episode. I'm very happy to see this new arc, um, as well as, you know, see some new characters from Universe 6. I kind of know a few of them when they're coming up, because, you know, I kind of kind of stay in the loop a little bit on what goes on with Super. I'm kind of looking forward to seeing some of those new characters in Universe 6. I'm not going to spoil anything in case you haven't seen, you know, you don't watch Super Sub, or you don't, or, like, if you only watch on Toonami like me, but you kind of, or if you don't really know, yeah, I'm not going to spoil it. So, yeah. Overall, very much looking forward to seeing the rest of this arc. I'm very, but I'm so hyped to see Goku Black. So, yeah, guys. Uh, overall, I give this episode an 8.5 out of 10. The great, there was some great art. There was some great art animation. You know, good. No tell ways to seem to like to improve the game and see if they can keep it up. And, yeah, overall, that's it. That's all. I'm looking forward to seeing the rest of the of the Shampa arc or this Universe 6. I'm very happy to see the rest of it. So, yeah, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you did, subscribe if you're new, and as always, come back for more. See you guys next time.